Managing apps on devices. The first step is to add apps to the app list. The app list contains all the apps that you can assign to users, user groups, and device groups. You can add apps from BlackBerry World, the App Store, Google Play, or Windows Phone Store. Click Apps. Click the Add an App icon. To add a BlackBerry app, click BlackBerry World. To search for an app, type the name of the app. In this example, search for WebEx. Click Search. Click Add. This screen provides screenshots and more information about the app. Click Add to add the app to the app list. Click Close. To add an iOS app, click App Store. Type WebEx to search for the iOS version of the Cisco WebEx Meetings app. Click Search. Click Add. This screen allows you to set options for apps, such as the supported device form factor and whether the app can be backed up on iCloud. You can also set whether users are prompted to install the app if you set it as a required app. Click Add to add the app to the app list. To add an Android app, click Google Play. This video shows how to add an Android app when BES12 is connected to a Google domain. In the app URL from Google Play text box, copy and paste the web address for the app from Google Play. In the search results, click Add beside WebEx. Select the Accept option to accept the app permissions on behalf of users. Click Next. Click Add to add the app to the app list. Click Close. To add a Windows app, click Windows Phone Store. Type WebEx to add the Windows Phone version of the Cisco WebEx Meetings app. You can optionally add an app description and the app vendor. For this example, type Cisco Systems Incorporated in the vendor field. You must add an icon for the app. You can download the icon from Windows Phone Store and store it on your computer. Click Browse to locate the icon. Select the icon that you want to add. Click Open. Copy the web address for the app from Windows Phone Store. Paste the web address in the App Web Address from Windows Phone Store field. Click Add to add the app to the app list. Click Close. Click Close. The next step is to create an app group. After you have added apps to the app list, you can use app groups to group the same app for multiple device types, or to group apps for users with the same role in your organization. If you want to manage apps on Android for work devices, you must add apps to an app group and enable the app group for Android for work. You can then assign the app group to a user or user group. You cannot assign an app for Android for work devices directly to a user account or user group. Click the Add an App Group icon. Select the Enable App Group for Android for Work option to create a group of apps that include apps that can be installed on Android for Work devices. Type a name for the app group. In this example, type WebEx Apps. Click the Add icon. Select the WebEx Apps. Click Add. Click Add. The final step is to assign an app group to a user group. After you have added apps to the app list, you can assign the app to users, user groups, or device groups. This video shows how to assign an app group to a user group. Click Groups. Click the group that you want to assign the apps to. Click the Settings tab. In the Assigned Apps section, click the Add icon. Select the WebEx Apps App Group. Click Next. Select whether you want the apps to be optional or required. In this example, select Required. Click Assign. This completes the task of managing apps on devices.